Garden State Park is ready to welcome the community for the Camellia Festival. Flowers just like these are going to be celebrated this weekend at the park this Saturday, February 15th. Let's learn a little bit more about what you need to know from Scarlett Dunn. She's a park services specialist here and over at Camp Helen. If she looks familiar, she's always filling us in on kind of the natural beauty of our area. So tell us about this Camellia Festival. It's something, again, family friendly, low cost people can attend. Sure. So it's going to take place this Saturday. The festival will be from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Um, we will have camellia experts here giving seminars throughout the day about the camellias themselves, air layering, um, which is how we kind of make camellias from other plants. Um, there'll be waxing of the camellia blooms, and then we'll have heritage presenters throughout the park. So you can learn about blacksmithing or making cedar sing shingle shakes, um, antique toy making. There'll be a band here playing on the stage all day and a food vendor. So it's a nice way to spend the afternoon. Yeah, absolutely. Especially Especially if it's, you know, kind of been like the weather we've had lately, it's going to be gorgeous out. Something people can use to get some fresh air right. and, of course, visit a local park. Tell us about cost of admission or anything like that that people need to know. Sure. So the cost of admission will be $4 per vehicle. Um, there will be parking here in the park and also at Bay Elementary School, which is right here around the park. Um, we'll have a shuttle that will also um, be bringing people into the park if you're not able to walk as well. Um, our friends group, uh, the Friends of Eden, will have camellias that will be uh, donation only so you can take home your very own camellia from Eden Gardens and um, yeah and then just costs for for food so but otherwise it's a very uh, affordable event for the family if you want to tour the house that is a separate fee it's four dollars um, per person it's cash or check only all right sounds good to us and of course we want to talk to for people who don't know about the significance of this flower to this park you guys have a really beautiful garden and we'll keep showing it of course <laughs> as it gets brighter outside but can I tell people what this this flower means to you guys here at Eden Gardens um, sure so we have over 260 65 camellias on the grounds here at Eden Gardens. Our benefactress Lois Maxson, who left her home um, to the park in 1968, um, had planted all of these gardens. And so we have hundreds of different varieties of camellias. We actually have our very own camellia that was cultivated especially for our park called Burgie's Eden, which I'm holding in my hand. Um, so that's very special to us as well. But I mean, we're a garden park and we're one of only four garden parks in the whole state of Florida. So it's very special to us. This is our annual festival, so we just encourage people to come out and walk amongst the blooms. Yeah, I <laughs> love that. Of course, Scarlett is going to keep filling us in, too, about the significance of this, and you can find links on mypanhandle.com to the Florida State Parks website. Well, there, those details will be there, too, to attend the Camellia Festival. She was telling me this flower variety is actually called the Drama Girl. Now, Lauren, I think if Chris Marshawn were here, he would tell me, oh, Mackenzie, that's perfect for you, but, you know, between the three of us girls on this team, we know he's he's the dramatic one. Yeah, safe call. He's not here. He would, he would totally say that. <laughs> All right.